Hi Leo and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Um, welcome to any new visitors or return subscribers. Thank you for your support so far. Um, please do like, comment, share and subscribe so I can keep this channel going. I do personal readings as well. So check the description below. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for May 2020. Oops, too many cards. So what I'm getting for your energy in May is, is you're going to have an ending of some sort. Um, might be of a relationship, might also be ending of patterns and behaviours. Crown in the reading, needing to be patient. It's like waiting for something new to come in, I'm getting here. And at the root of the reading, yeah, your wishes, thinking about what you want, strongly I'm getting, wanting to move on. In your past, we've got Queen of Swords, Libra potentially, could also be Aquarius or Gemini. Maybe this is who you had the ending with. Let's clarify this Queen of Swords. Yes, definitely, it was definitely a connection with these two. A strong connection, maybe a twin flame connection for some of you um, in your home. But we've got here the world, yeah, so an ending for some of you. Or an ending of a phase with, you know, with this person. But for a lot of you, I'm getting that this relationship ended um, in your future we've got the magician starting again definitely coming through Gemini or Virgo anything else for your future yeah we've got a soulmate coming in strong connection um, and it could be an Aries Leo Sagittarius, a message definitely coming through in divine timing. You may feel at a standstill for a while, but you've got your own card here, the most positive card in the deck. Um, a positive future will come will come through for you. There could be a child involved. Um, and it could be a Pisces as well. Let's clarify with the angel cards for you. Okay, well, there's a repeat card there. Um, Four of Wands, so a strong connection, twin flame. It might be this person coming back. Okay, for it to be repeated from past to future. I'm strongly getting that. Um, but peace, abundance, happy home life. Page of Cups, yeah, this can either be the relationship starts a new phase, so that phase ended. You start a new one or a new person cancer scorpio pisces potentially and this is pretty special 
Leo, this feels like a really strong, connect, good connection. To have the king and queen of earth is a, is a power couple. Um, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. Successful time. And both of you, you know, can manifest with that magician. I'm really strongly getting twin flame here, actually. Um, being understanding, having that Midas touch, I'm feeling. Together you can, like, have anything you want. The moon at the bottom of the deck, um, more Pisces energy. Things might not appear as they seem. Okay, there's things going on behind the scenes and you might have a little bit of fear that you need to release in this situation. Um, yeah, needing to make a decision. Maybe a little bit of confusion if this person comes back. But there's a lot of love. Yeah, ace of water, resurgence of a relationship, I'm really getting here. Definitely a new home for some of you and spiritual growth. Okay, Leo, so I hope that reading may have resonated for you. Please do like, comment and subscribe if it did. And I'll see you again soon.